Hello guys! Today I would like to open a new topic, which is the future of the Jiu festivals and how that is also your concern. And to set the stage for my thoughts, I have to say that a month has passed since uh, the Jiu Master Masterclass in Croatia has ended and it was just amazingly unbelievable experience. It was full and full of people with so much love and so much love for the didgeridoo. Uh, we very recently came back from the elementary festival in UK, which is an amazing didgeridoo festival, meeting so many beautiful people, so much ditch playing around, stands, and that festival happiness uh, in the air. You know what I'm talking about, hopefully. And that gave so much hope. At the same time, soon there will be the first weekend of August and there won't be a new Eisenbach didgeridoo gathering, which has been going on for around 25 years. And it was very important in my personal history and personal uh, and in my didgeridoo history because I, I went there as a young player and I established many new contacts. It was important for me to have the experience, but also financially it gave me a lot of support, you know, especially in the early years of my professional didgeridoo career. Um, so that is not going to happen for, well, reasons I will not present to you. But I can tell you that the whole scene is suffering on many levels. One is being tormented for three years by COVID, but also just the wave of interest uh, in the Jiridu is changing and people are changing, times are changing as well as the weather. So I'm thinking, how is it in our interest, how is it in our best interest to navigate through these new events? And I'm thinking that the Jiridu festivals are a very important uh, part uh, of our uh, scene of our culture. This is where we exchange the actual experiences with the actual people rather than just being in this two-dimensional space on social media. And many ditch festivals at this moment have really hard time, you know, and they need you. And I figured that I want to give you this message because it's in your best interest to support the festivals. And there are three main things that you can do for the scene that I've thought of. One is, the, which involves um, the least energy, is just to support the events online, share them and make all people aware of that. The other is to attend the events. Um, just show up, you know. You will be rewarded for your showing up. And the third is to actually organize an event by yourself. This doesn't need to be something grandiose, you know. It can be just uh, a, a didgeridoo gathering, a club which runs every once a month, or once in two months, or once in two weeks. Or it can be a very small festival, or it can be a bigger festival, or it can be a huge festival. But usually you need to start growing uh, from the small seed. But I feel you know, there is something for, for each of us, if we want to grow, we have to grow the scene which helps us grow. You understand that concept, that principle of our interconnectedness? I, I feel you do, you know, because the people who play Ditch resonate with this kind of ideas. And now is good time. We are now in the, in the middle of summer, so there will be still some more festivals. But now you can take a deep inhalation, get it all in, and see what the next exhalation is. What is your next spiraling out going to be? How you can get involved and um, start swirling with the others and building up the energy again. Huge thanks for Eddie and Eva for organizing uh, the Eisenbach event for so many years and giving us so much goodness. Thanks so much to everyone who has ever gave their heart and time and energy to um, organize a Digi event. I remember those incredible Austrian that you do festivals 20 years ago in the mountains of the Green Lake. When you see the photos of that, you're just amazed that people gather around a simple tube 
in such a middle of nowhere place and have incredible time together. And that power of bonding shouldn't be underestimated still. It is quite timeless, I feel, for the human form in which we live. And thanks so much to all the other festival organizers, but also thank to you who will listen to this call of getting involved, getting in action, and start building up the energy, swirling the beauty, and spiraling out and bringing us to the new places of new experiences in the digital world that we would really love to experience, but we can't do it without you. So keep sharing, keep attending, and start organizing a little something. Thanks so much. See you soon. Spiral out. Keep digging.